pulse ox, blood oxygen saturation or SpO2 is basically a measure of the amount of oxygen in your blood. It is vital for keeping track of your health, especially for people affected by any lung or heart condition. Garmin watches are equipped with a pulse oximeter sensor that tracks your SpO2 levels throughout the day. In this video, I'll show you how to turn on or off the pulse ox settings on your Garmin, how you can set all day pulse ox mode on your Garmin. Let's start. For the demonstration, I'm using my Garmin 400 265, but you can follow the same process to check or take pulse ox on your Garmin 400, Venue, Phoenix or any other watch. To get started, simply tap the up button to access the menu and scroll down to find the pulse ox widget. Open it to view your blood oxygen saturation. Now press and hold the up button to access your pulse ox options. Here, there are three options available. All day, during sleep and on demand. If you select the on demand, then you'll have to measure blood oxygen manually whenever you like. Obviously, if you select the during sleep, then it'll measure your blood oxygen saturation while you sleep. And if you select all day, then your Garmin will automatically measure your SpO2 every five minutes all throughout the day when you're not moving. For people with certain health conditions, all-day SpO2 monitoring is crucial. It can help them be aware of any changes in their body that they should be aware of. However, keep in mind that all-day SpO2 monitoring will increase your battery consumption, so you might notice a slight dip in battery performance. And that's it. Now you know how to enable and customize pulse ox tracking on your Garmin watch. Whether you prefer to monitor it all day, during sleep or just on demand, you've got full control over your health tracking. Just remember, while all-day monitoring provides valuable insights, it can impact battery life. So choose the setting that works the best for you. If you found this video helpful, then don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to Wearholic for more Garmin tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you in the next one.